That, that was one of the first and foremost design criteria. It was what we call carefree abandon. The airplane must be able to take care of itself. The pilot can do whatever he wants to do with the stick and throttle, and he cannot damage or hurt the airplane in any way or the equipment. So that's part of carefree abandon. And the cockpit side, very strictly disciplined to provide you, the pilot, a picture of the situation around your airplane without knowing whether you need it, whether you're seeing it on the radar warning receiver or on the radar or a sensor, another sensor. We had what was called sensor fusion. You have sensors on the airplane that can see out around the airplane. And what you do is you take that information in from multiple sensors and put them into a single solution. There are two airplanes at your right two o'clock position, 47 miles X number of speed. That reduces the pilot to a tactician, not a systems operator. And that's very important when you're traveling at these high speeds and closing quickly on the enemy. And so, uh, yeah, that, that was uh, the big push was to use the avionics to simplify the pilot task.